Hi there. If you want to get a new experience or want to fresh up your PC or just want to have a new life in your PC like I have this 20 year old laptop which got nothing but more than a half to go RAM and a very old style on your processor, I'm going to install Chrome OS on this. So check it out. You will need two things for this process, a laptop or a PC on which you are going to be installing Chrome OS and a flash drive. Start by opening Google on your PC and search for Cloud Ready. Or you can just directly go to nervware.com and click on the download link. Here you will be presented with three options. If you are a company, you can sign up for beta. If you are an institute, you can get the license for $60. But for this video, I'm going to be clicking on home and the download will begin. I'm not going to download because I already have done it. For the next step, open Google Chrome, go to settings and then click on extension. Scroll down to the bottom and click on get more extensions. It will open Google Chrome Web Store. Now you need to search for Chromebook Recovery Utility. And then download the first result. Wait for it to install. Now open it up. And on the top right side, there is a gear icon. Click on it and select use local image. Then select the file you have downloaded. Now insert your USB thumb drive and select it. Preferably 8 or 16 gigs. Click on create now and the process will begin. Now wait for it to complete. Uh, for me it took about 30 minutes so don't panic when it gets above 100%. Set the USB drive to the PC where you want to install Chrome OS and boot it from the drive. Now after it opens, on the bottom left corner, open the menu and click install cloud ready. From there again hit install cloud ready. Now you can either choose to dual boot with windows or you can stand alone installation. I prefer to do a standalone installation to get the total experience. But keep in mind it will erase all your data on the device. Now just wait for it to install and it took me about a good 20 minutes to do it. And also your computer will be shut down after it completes the installation. Now boot up your device and you have Chromebook. Now connect to your internet and sign up with a Google account if you don't have one already. But not to make complications, I just sign in as a guest. So thanks for watching this video, if you found it helpful please like it, if you disliked it, you know what to do. I highly recommend turning the red subscribe button into a grey subscribe button. And as always, take care and next time you will see. So to solve this problem, let's try and draw this time.